Over the last 20 years, I've had a tremendous amount of fun creating my own garden behind Ashwood Nurseries with lots of excellent help. I'd hate you to think that I've done it all by myself. The three acre garden backs onto the staff's Worcester Canal, which is the dominating feature and creates a garden of curves. My inspiration has come from many sources, probably from every garden I've ever visited, but especially from the late Princess Sturzer and my dear friend Veronica Cross. Both taught me how to garden. I know I'm growing old because I've started to love ferns. Very popular in Victorian times, they're a particular favourite of mine, especially when the fronds start to unfurl in spring. They bring a certain elegance and serenity to the garden. Four acre extension to the garden is dedicated to encouraging wildlife. Access to long mown paths, Tom has introduced lots of native wildflowers to attract butterflies, moths and insects and has created a pond to encourage amphibians to take up residence. My garden has also become a safe haven for nesting birds, learning to live alongside their human counterparts, the huge range of plants providing a rich source of nutritious seeds and insects on which to raise their young. I'm passionate about conifers. They bring colour and structure to the garden throughout the year. And in spring comes the excitement of new growth and developing cones. The history of the garden has not been without tragedy. The loss of Adam, a much esteemed head gardener, at a tragically early age has inspired a further expansion to create a lasting memorial of a young life lost far too early. Here in Adam's garden we have planted a drift of taller growing conifers to form a backdrop giving protection from cold easterly winds. I couldn't live without my dogs, Poppy and Willow. Although they bring their own brand of chaos, they're a very important part of the garden. Under head gardener Nigel Hopes, we have a team of dedicated and passionate gardeners. But a garden isn't just about a collection of well-nurtured plants, it holds happy memories of gardening friends who live on through the plants that they've generously given you over the years.